Well, I was at Crown Hill, and they was born in Crown Hill at my mom's. Mm -hmm. On the hill. And uh, they were put in a trunk. Mm -hmm. See, you got all this thing. Yep, they were born. They were born they were February, premature. Yeah, born they February were, the 3rd, 1939. One of them was one pound, nine ounces, or? One was two pound, one was two pound and a half. Two pound and a half, okay. Two, that might be, yeah. Oh, yep. And uh, so the uh, doctor delivered them, and then what did he do? Well, he, t he took one, and then that basin, a miner's basin. What are those? That was a coal miner's dinner, Coal miner's dinner lunch, bucket. lunch bucket. Lunch bucket. And he put water in that, and he washed one around in it, wrapped it up in a, or in a diaper. Mm -hmm. Then he washed another one and wrapped They're, it up. Now, the dinner buckets, they're probably... Probably a foot high, like when eight called. inches, yeah, eight inches wide. And uh, then we had to fill the fruit jars up. My mother and so after you, after he washed them, you put them all in uh, in a trunk, put them in a trunk, an old trunk, and you put quart jars of water in there. We had two half a gallons of water, and I think four quarts, because you had one bottle jar here and one baby here and one. Doll up here and one baby down there. And then you had one to the foot and one to the head. Keeping so, up eating there. Keeping up you know, kind of an incubator. An that's incubator. what was. They'd have never lived. Where'd there. that old trunk come from? You just had that. That was my grandmother's. Your grandmother's trunk. Yep. And what happened the next few days? Well, when the doctor come up the next morning, he asked the neighbors at the bottom of the hill. He said, Miss Massey, if y'all heard anything about them? On the hill, when babies on the hill, and she said we ain't heard a thing. Yeah. He said, "Well, they still must be alive," because he didn't even think they were there. Yeah. So they stayed in that for I couldn't tell you how many months. Uh huh. And now they're 60 years old each. <laughs> See, and we put the kids in a hole. Yeah. <laughs> but my brother-in-law told my sister said, or my sister told my brother-in-law said. That, now, Dode, if you hear um, the babies cry, mm -hmm. holler at me. He come through there and he said, I, I heard some kind of squeaking in that. But I don't know whether you'd call it crying or what, because well, they wasn't, it would be they wasn't you know, formed enough to cry. Right, right. 